The saying, two is better than one, is certainly true when it comes to stacking pancakes. It happens to also be the case when stacking switches. In this edition of Tech Talks, we'll show how to stack two CBS 350 switches using the CLI, next. First, we need to make sure our STP uplink ports are connected. Once that's finished, we'll log into the active switch. We can enter in our username and password. Inside, we'll enter the command terminal. To do that, we need to enter conf t, or configure terminal, for the long version of the command. We can then enter in stack unit 1. This will allow us to enter stack configuration links te1-2 unit-id1. This command is telling the switch which ports we're going to use for the uplink. Next, we want to exit the command terminal and enter the privileged exec mode. To save our configuration, we'll enter copy run start. Okay, now we can restart the switch. We'll enter reload and then Y to continue. We'll configure our standby switch now. We'll log into that switch and enter in our username and password. To enter the configuration terminal, we'll type in conf t one more time. We can then enter in stack unit one. And now we'll enter in stack configuration links te1-2 unit-id2. Since this is our standby switch, we want to give it a unit ID of two. To get out of configuration mode, we'll enter end. Again, we'll enter copy run start to save our configuration. Once we've saved the configuration, we'll restart the switch by entering reload. It'll ask us to continue, so we'll enter Y. Once they're done rebooting, they should be in stack configuration. Let's check to make sure. We can log into the active switch and enter show stack. This will show us all the switches in our stack. It shows that our active switch has unit ID 1 and our standby switch has unit ID of 2. Another way to check is through the command show stack config. This shows us that our switch is currently configured and stacked. We can check our system LED lights to make sure we have stacked our switches correctly. Once the switches are stacked, they will advertise the stack ID every 20 seconds with the system LED. The top switch is our active switch, so the LED will stay a steady green. The bottom switch is the standby switch, so its LED will correspond to its unit ID. The switch's unit IDs are two, so they will blink twice. We're all finished. That's how to stack two CBS 350 switches using the CLI. Thanks for watching this edition of Tech Talks. We'll see you next time.